every month, it gets more lit and more lit. I just keep growing, I keep progressing. And my career keeps going crazier. It just feels like a dream for real, cause I used to dream about this. You know, I'm stuck in it now. So it just feels good. You don't get what you don't deserve. So if you deserve some shit, you gonna get it. But if you don't deserve that shit, you don't get, you're not gonna get that shit. So I feel like I deserved it. That's why I got it. I wouldn't be here if I didn't deserve this. If I didn't work every day for this. Like you gotta work every day for what you want. I was in Atlanta at the time, for a while now, I think. And we, I was just in my hotel room, and Royce was just like, I got this 5B, you probably fuck with it. So I already like, had some shit written, and I was like, that type of style. You know, in the hotel room where it's like, the t right, where the TV's at and shit, they always got the little table thing. Like, we just set up the mic, like, we just made, like, we used, like, the icebox in there, in the hotel room, we used, like, some random shit, like, the clock. It's like some, some throwback, back in the day, set up, like, some old school shit, like, before you had anything type shit. When I heard the song, I knew, I knew it was perfect for Gunner. Like, this is his, this is his style. He sent the verse back and he really killed that bitch. Like, for real. I just knew that shit was over it. Like, it's, it's one of those songs that's like, out of there. Still popping Zans, 2019. Pull the link, I mean, stuck in a dream. It started at 2018. We just had to, I had to change the word for, cause we dropped in 2019, but that song made in 2018, but I don't take drugs no more, so. So you know that, that's for y'all. Drugs in general just be killing people. That shit just, like, mentally and physically, you know? So that shit just not good for you. Since I stopped doing all that, it's just like, you know, I've been paying attention to my money, paying attention to everything I do, like, way more. Like, before I didn't really watch where this money was going, where that money was going, I was just going crazy. But now I be watching, like, oh, I made this much, so I got this much, and I only spent that much, so I know how much I, you know? Like, I just been watching everything, like, making sure I'm good, making sure my family good. We started at Licks back in 2014. I mean, you know, my first Licks was, like, plugs. In my head, he can't snitch on me. How could he snitch on me? He's selling me drugs right now. So, fuck it, I'm gonna just take that. What are you gonna do? I got an ice on me dripping saline. You know what saline is, right? Saline drops, man. Like, contact. Like, imagine, like, you know, it's dripping saline, it's dripping all this water in front of me, all that. It's like the purest, you know, type of drip, type of water you could just splash, you feel me? So I got the ice on me dripping saline. You know the vibe, man. Flawless came in off a hunt. Me and my niggas still dripping for fun. Ben knew I was the one. Still got niggas on the run, yeah. I just knew I was different than everybody else, like, as a little kid. I used to play basketball and stuff. I used to, like, play sports or so like once like I started getting good at that for real. Like I started like, you know, feeling myself. I started getting hoes. And I was just like, yeah, I'm the one. I got these diamonds in my chain swing. I just picked up the snowflake necklace, but I, I left it in at my crib in Miami. I, ain't, I don't like bringing it everywhere I go. Cause that's that was that's the real the real big boy right there. But this is my first like real chain I got. Um this is the Gucci snake. If I just be like looking, you feel me, just moving around, just, that's my chain swing. It just feels good to have it on, you feel me? But I'm not, I'm, I'm probably not gonna keep on jewelry. Like, it's not even worth it. I'm gonna still buy some more pieces, but once I'm really like racked out and I like just got, I don't really care no more. Like, what I'm, what else am I gonna spend this money on? I got these bands and shit changed. I feel like the same exact nigga. Nothing's changed. I still bring my same niggas on. I still got the same bros. Like, if I'm not near you no more, if I'm not around you, that means you did something wrong. That means you did something. Cause I definitely wouldn't have switched on you for no reason. Talking like you want that smoke. We want the same thing. Big gas. <laughs> Smoking shit. I got a brand new check. Then I put 10 on my neck. Mm, then I got a new put tech. Yeah, flying that bitch with a tech. You know, if you looked at my my recent interviews. It was one of my jeans interviews, so I think, you know, I'm not from here. So, you know, I came here on a blimp and, you know, I had a bunch of technology in that bitch. So I came in with the tech. And I flew in that bitch with the tech. For real. 600 new fit, 54 drop top. If you put down 50 on a down payment, how much you think you spending a month? On the, if you lease the car, like, if you put 50 down, come on, man. You drop the bag. Cause ain't nobody putting 50 down. Not regular people is not putting fifty down. I'm not talking about fifty thousand all together on the whole drop top. That if it was fifty thousand dollar drop top, man, that's it. Nineteen seventy two. I'm talking about fifty down on down payment. Cause that was a big ass, expensive ass whip. Fuck is you saying? I was off bean tech made me walk tight. One time, it only, I only it only happened to me one time. But one time I was off a of bean, and then I I had some green high tech. Lean, put that bitch up, and niggas is like. 
in a real like daydreaming for like just hearing like I was hearing my bros talk and I was just replying like they was hearing me talk they was hearing each other talk and we just kept talking like what you say you ain't saying that we was like damn this shit crazy like this shit not the way we was not fucking with it though but that's what I'm talking about walk talking never been on lame ain't shit to make a top drive smoking on gas or what I lift off. Last year was broke, this year flooded a paddock. I keep 40 racks in my Seattle attic. 14 racks, cause like, you know, my my family still live over there. So we still like, you know, we, I still be over there sometimes. But like, save that for a rainy day. Take some take some money away. You know I mean? just got to. Got hit it two times and you niggas can have my young nigga pull up and shoot like the magic. Shoot like the team. But like, it's like, you know, magic got the way he pulled up and just psh, pushed him away that fast. That's crazy. But my young niggas will pull up on that. I feel like they still looking at Seattle like, what is it? Lil Mosey is not the Seattle sound, I don't think. Like, so like, I feel like there's not really a sound of Seattle. Like, there's just a bunch of different stars out there that's gonna go crazy.